What up, what up, it's your main man, Jinko, the movie Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings starring Simu Lu. Shang-Chi. In the movie, they actually say it's like pronounced Shang-Chi. Shang-Chi. And my house is gonna get messed up anyway, though. Like, you're not gonna get a whole bunch of black people on board to say this name right. Especially with my folks. Boy, I just came back from seeing that Shang-Chi. Charlie Ray is actually pronounced Shang-Chi. Boy, I shame your chi. Shang-Chi. Shang-Chi. Talking about the dog old Shang-Chi. Yeah, man, so we might not pronounce it good in our house. <laughs> the basic premise is this. Simu Lu plays Shang-Chi. He's a guy that lives in San Francisco. He's a regular, everyday, average guy. But the truth is, this dude is a stone cold killer. He's been trained since he was a little boy to be a living weapon. You know what it takes to do something like that? First of all, you gotta work out. You gotta train vigorously. You can't care about life. You probably gotta jaywalk a couple times just to show that you don't care about the institution. And then you can't have asthma. You can't be doing kung fu and having an asthma attack. I am Shane Chi, living weapon. <laughs> <laughs> that was a tough one right there. So his father trained him to be a lethal warrior, and now his father's come back to get something from him, and Shun needs to figure out what it is and save the day. So what did I think? This movie is really good. I think Marvel had a misstep with Black Widow, but I think they finished the summer off right with this one. The acting was good. Character development was good too. They had a great adventure with this movie. The plot makes sense. There's a few low points in the plot that makes it seem like the movie stalls out, but it gets really good once you get to the action. And the two best things about this movie is the action, number one. They're really on point with it, and the fighting is amazing. You wouldn't enjoy the fighting, but the things I really liked about it is the cinematography when it came to the action. They put the camera in places that you can't believe that they would put it in. <laughs> That sounded really bad. They utilized the camera motion to really enhance the action. Whoever this cinematographer was on this movie, hey, cut the check, cause they did it. And one of the best things about this movie is that we have a solid, really good representation of a superhero for the Asian community. So what did you think about Shang Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings? Did you like it? Did you hate it? What did you think about the Kung Fu? Subscribe and comment below and I love to hear from you. Get back to you and if you like this video, click that like button. Alright y'all, I'm your main man Jinko, peace, look, eight town down, so I'll catch you to the side and he is looking at you, black dude on film.